How you doing everybody? My name's Chad and I'm gonna do a walkthrough today of my club car 6x4. My little hunting buggy. Been working on this thing for about a year and a half now and it's finally coming together. Here y'all go. Here it is. My 6x4 club car DS. This is my little hog hunting rig right here. I bought it from a buddy of mine about a year and a half ago. It was all camo. The rear didn't have any lift to it. The blocks were missing. But the front has got a six inch Jake's lift. I put some work into this thing this last year. I got it, it wasn't running. Had to put new batteries in it. Still wasn't running. I replaced both solenoids. Oh, both solenoids. If you didn't notice, there's two axles, four wheels in the rear. It's four wheel drive in the back, selectable either two wheel drive or four wheel drive. This thing will get it. I've killed quite a few hogs out of this buggy. The bed tilts. Well, there's two more batteries in the rear. There's six under the front seat. It is 48 volts. It's got its own little toolbox. It's got the winch in. Zip ties. Stuff I need throughout in the field. Keep my shooting sticks on it. Got me a green LED light bar. This thing's pretty cool. What it is, is a club car DS. They chop it in half, they make a kit that adds on this whole back section. The bed, the toolbox, another axle with a motor. This thing's pretty cool. It's taking some work. I peeled all the camo vinyl off of it. I got a picture of it stripped down, nothing but aluminum. I've had it in the mud a few times, not by choice. These things are really hard to clean. There's always something electrical that's going to get wet. I've replaced both the solenoids. There's two speed controllers mounted underneath this panel. One of them was burnt up, had to get it rebuilt. I redid all the brakes. None of them worked when I got it. But these old drum brakes, you get them muddy and they're done. You got to clean them every time you get mud on them. It's got a hitch in the front to mount the winch. It had a full windshield. Uh... I got kids. It didn't make it. I'll get better with a half anyways and shoot off of it. When I got it, the leaf springs were also busted. Did some repair work on them. It's got a trailer hitch in the rear. It was in bad shape. But it goes now. I was thinking about putting some newer wheels and tires on it. Those are 23s, I believe. 22 by 11s. It's a little dirty. It's a little old. This thing's 21 years old. Still running. Love this little thing. It's got a brush guard on the front. My kids drive this more than I do. And it's usually my daughter, who is six, pulling my wife out of the ditch on the lawnmower. But this thing's a work in progress. Still got some stuff I want to do to it. If y'all got any ideas what else I could do to it, leave a message on that. Leave me a comment. Just 
So let me know what y'all think. Look good. It's pretty rare. I haven't seen anything else like it on the internet. One time I had it out. I was going to check a camera. And I knew I had hogs at that feeder. I was sending pictures to my phone. I get about 100 yards from the feeder. Stop the cart. Get off and start walking. I make it about 10 feet. Look through my thermal. And there's a hog 10 feet in front of me. Never saw it. Never heard me. I shot it. Got up, kept walking down to the other one, ended up being a coon left at my feeder. This thing is stealthy. Had to get a few rattles out of it. Other than that, it'll go. I was trailing it back one day and I didn't have any batteries strapped down. Hit a bump on the interstate, one of the batteries came loose and ripped all the wires out of the speed controller. Got home and it wouldn't unload off the trailer. But I figured out where they all went. Got them back going again. My daughter's run it into the house a couple times. It's tough. I had to put a new charger on it. The uh, onboard computer went out on me. So I had to put a smart charger on it so it knows when to turn off. But it's a pretty clean little buggy. Bought it off a buddy of mine. He let it sit for three or four years. Didn't know what was wrong with it. Nobody around town knew how to work on it. So I bought it off of them. Spent more on batteries than I did for the buggy. I painted it a bronze to match my truck. Still dark. Still hides well in the woods. Let me know what y'all think. What else can I do to it? Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. I think I may throw some wheels and tires on it. Go have a good day.